for St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV. Just minutes can mean life or death during a heart attack. Dr. Lars Runquist explains how Roper St. Francis's aggressive approach to shortening time to treatment is saving lives. The goal in a heart attack is to open the, the artery that is causing the heart attack as quickly as possible. In Charleston County, we now begin uh, doing EKGs in the field with the EMS team. It's electronically faxed to the emergency room and if the emergency room doctor deems it's a heart attack, they then call in a cardiologist and the cath team now even before the patients arrived at the hospital. And that speeds up the process, allowing doctors to treat the blocked artery faster. And that's referred to as dortable in time. What it means to patients is uh, more likelihood of surviving a life-threatening heart attack. Rupert St. Francis's average door to balloon time is quicker than the national goal of 90 minutes. I think the whole Roper St. Francis emergency room system has taken a, 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 an aggressive approach to treating heart attack and stroke and, and pushing forward on an aggressive door to balloon time. For more information, call 402 CARE. For House Calls TV, I'm Merritt Dempsey. Roper St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV.